Hey y'all, Rick Fearless Fearless, Strokers Dallas, Strokers House House, Punch Wally Garage and Fearless Insurance Services. How you doing? Good morning, boys and squirrels, uh, girls, good morning. Today is Thursday, August 31st, 2023, year of our Lord. So... Yesterday was my wife's birthday. We went out to eat, had a good meal, had some laughs, drove around in my 69 Chevy pickup truck that I call Alice, and went home to our three old English sheepdogs. Today is my brother Randy's birthday. So Rand and I are 11 months apart. I'm 11 months older than my brother. My mom had me at 17 and ran at 18. So she always raised us as Irish twins. She'd say, your Irish twins would say, Ma, please don't dress us alike. We're not twins. And she'd say, you're 11 months. You're Irish twins. So Rand and I have been best friends all our lives. All our lives we've been best friends. So for one month a year... We're the same age. This is the month. So I'm 66, and he turns 66 today. So happy birthday to my big shot brother, Randy. Randy is a lawyer in Houston. He went to the University, University of Houston uh, Law School. Never came home. He's outside of Houston. So today's episode of In My Life, the 365 Project, the Mr. Peabody Wayback Machine is going to take us back to 1975. That's the year we graduated high school. Well, back then you could drink at 18. Rand and I and, and David Allen a lot of times we would go to these beer joints, and Rand, Rand was excellent pool player. Excellent pool player. So he would, uh, you know, he'd say, hey, you want to go shoot some pool tonight for money? What that meant was, Rand would shoot pool for money, and I was 50-50. So if Rand lost... I paid half of what he lost, but if he won, we split what he won. If they wanted to play doubles, I would play with him. Rand rarely lost. He still has a pool table uh, in his house. He rarely loses in pool. So I remember one time we were shooting pool. The guy, uh, you know, sometimes they get tough. You know, because you're getting beat by a 17, 18 year old guy. And uh, one guy got tough. And when he did, another guy that was this big mean dude came over and he said, Hey, the kid whooped your butt, pay him the money. I don't think I want to pay him. The guy said, You're either going to pay him or you're going to pay me. So the guy paid him the money. So, happy birthday to my Irish twin. Welcome to 66. I hope it's better for you than it is for me. I'll be 67 next month. Check the truck. Oh, look what we have here. So, these are some white chucks that my employees had tie-dyed for me. So you've got the colors, you've got strokers on there, you've got the red, white, and blue Chuck Taylor All-Star logo. That one's got the hamsters logo. A skull on the side. What's this one got on the side? Oh, there's the skull right there. An eight ball. And I would say 
I'd say these some good looking shoes. The red and the black racing stripe. One eye down, double knotted for safety. I like these shoes. So you double knot them for safety to keep an old man from falling over his shoestrings. Dad joke. Any kid will run an errand for you if you ask them at bedtime. True. Throwback word. It's a phrase. Made in the shade. Man, that cat's got it made in the shade means you got it going on, it means you successful, it means you know what you're doing. He's made in the shade. What's old Jimmy been lately? I don't know, man, but I heard he's got it made in the shade. All right, all right. That's what made in the shade means. Uh, motivational minutes. Find a way, not an excuse. What does that mean, Ricky Fairless? That means it's easy to say, oh, it, yeah, no, I don't, you know, I, I know that's not going to work. I, you know, I, I'm not going to be able to do that. Oh, that's easy. Not going to be able to do it. Go get back on the couch. Find a way, not an excuse. When I wanted to open my own business, I hit hundreds of roadblocks. I could have gave up any number of times. One time the banker pissed me off so bad I started to quit right then. But I didn't. I got disappointed. Then I got mad. Then I got motivated. And I said, no. Something may derail my plans, but it ain't going to be that. And I kept pushing and scratching and fighting and clawing and kicking. And I got, I got where I wanted to be. I made it to where I wanted to be. Okay. Check Rick's office. Okay, we're going to go through here. So if you take the tour Fridays at 4.30, you get to see all this. You get to see my office. Hey, Glidden Paint, they still send me a check every month. Thank you, Glidden Paint. So this is the family room with all kinds of pictures. So here's a picture of my brother and I and our Uncle Alan when we were seniors in high school. See, we had long hair. Can you tell which one's me and which one's my brother? There's one of us. There's Uncle Alan. There's the other one of us. So happy birthday. Happy birthday to my Irish twin. Tell me which one of those is me and which one's Ren. Happy birthday to my Irish twin, Randy. Love you, brother. Don't know what I'd do without you. Okay. Stroker's Dallas merch, M-E-R-C-H dot com. Tours every Friday at 4.30. If you're here, I'd love to show you around. See all the behind the scenes stuff that most people don't get to see. Did you mark the anniversary party, October 27th, 28th, and 29th? And that's it. Uh, yeah, it's going to be another hot weekend, but it's almost September. We'll get through this. You know what they say, we got it made in the shade. Love you. Bye, y'all.